Good evening, everyone, and welcome to Die Young Part 1. Uh, right, we'll try adventure mode for now, because I just come into this. I was born into the high life. I've always liked to exceed, always loved strong sensations. I experiment with everything. I've never been an addict, just more of an adrenaline junkie. My crowd has always been the people living on the edge. Still, nothing could have prepared me for what happened on that island. Dun dun dun. It was supposed to be the joyride of the summer. Rashid said it was all a done deal. He said we'd rule the beach after. <laughs> we had no idea what we were headed into. Nightmares have a way of just happening. Everything was a blur, but I was sure of it. I'd been buried alive. Spooky. I... I feel dizzy. Where am I? My throat hurts. Water. I need water. Piece of paper. Right, so we're in a well. Great start. There's a small island. It's probably bigger than I realised, but looks small. Great start. A compass. That mechanic there reminds me, I don't know if anyone remembers, was a Jurassic Park game that came on PC years ago. I don't know if that was it's uh, distracting. There's a PC game where the character had a tattoo on a chest and you had to look down to see your health because the developers wanted to be natural and they always had a one hand mechanic because they were rushed. It's maybe advanced at the time. You can find on YouTube uh, the angry, angry video game there actually did a whole video on it, so it was a good watch. Now how do I jump? That's crouch. I, I did examine the map. Oh, that. Oh, right. I see. That's a lot bigger than expected. Okay. Oh, the red mark, line with the well, find the swans, the swans, find the... Right. Okay. Right, so that's block. Ah, ah right. <laughs> Jump. Feel like I'm on fear factor. I thought I would die down there. Probably eaten. They made the music is so dramatic. That's, that's my stick. Wish I had a shot. Ah, save. Quick save. I don't want to do. That's a long save. There we go. I really want to say this is my boom stick, but. There's no boom. Right. 9.30 a.m. 9.30. 9.03. Okie dokie. So I guess that's why. Must be a really strong fella to move that.
Ah, oh, cool. Hello. That's it, run away. I've got a stick. Ugh, what are we saying now in five minutes when a ravaged dog comes after me? Oh, that's cool. Mum's favourite flower. Okay. I hate when it tells you when to cry. Crouch, because it often means it's giving you a quick tutorial on how to get away from an enemy. Nothing yet. I've got no stick. Run away. Oh, I had a dead rat. Alright. August 8th. I went into this note in case. I don't have to tell. Mm -hmm. I won't read out loud with them, tell them read out loud. Right. Car game or wood, that's fair. Did he just do the moonwalk? Okay. Nice, food. Want to eat it? I'll figure that out later. Making a lot of things. What is that? I wonder if that's the axe man she's talking about or he's talking about. Guessing that's it. Oh, is it over there? This is just finding places, I suppose. I'll try that one because it's the closest. Oh. 
Sneaky, sneaky, sneaky. Skin it. Won't do that just yet, because I haven't got a knife. Ooh, hello. I don't think I can kill you with my stick. That's one of my friends. Don't know where he's gone. Freeman, not Morgan Freeman. Yeah. Half Life 2, I'm on about. I won't try and attack the guy with the giant axe because I'll probably die. Campfire. Utility belt. Nice. Batman. Oh, hello. Yeesh. It doesn't look like they brought him out here for a tan. Uh, he's bruised black and blue. Things a bit worse than bruised. Is that guy in the distance? Hmm. <laughs> Let's get my bearings. So if I'm there, if I 
there's a spire. Ah, there we go. Sorry, I just bought that wolf. That wolf fox was going to eat that rabbit. Right, let's go to that building first. for the minute. Ah, fruit. Yeah, as I was ooh, as I was saying before, I was trying to do Evil 4 on professional mode on the last playthrough, but unfortunately I've gone rusty and the yeah it's just a camera and the audio is just absolutely terrible. So, I'm going to leave that for now and hopefully, as I get some better equipment, I might go back to it. But at the moment, I'm going to stick with the current setup I've got at the moment. Because, one, you can actually hear me, and two, you can actually see me better instead of being five seconds slower. Than my actual speak and speak of five seconds slower. What happens to those animals? I need better food, and this does not look friendly. At least it's a safe place. Rashid? Rashid! Oh, fuck! This can't be happening! Why? Why? You might have been an asshole, but you don't deserve this. I haven't found her alive, sadly. Can I open it? Ooh. 
friend in each well. No Assassin Creed climb in the sink. Stop throwing stones. What is that? That's a rabbit. Bit of ash. I know I did it, but I wasn't expecting that. Let's see what terrors lies in here. Hold on. That's the coastal tower marked on the map. Must be the way to get down from here and reach the shore below. Keep pressing R1 as, uh, sorry, L1. I'm guessing I can't jump. I do like the detail on the model. We can actually see your feet and everything. Oh, we're going this room, are we? How long is it? jump on it. Uh, uh. Yeah, I kind of guess avoid the stray dogs. I, hmm. There we go. Oh, butterfly. Which I can't kill. Did I get the bloody map? Rashid? Rashid! Oh fuck! This can't be happening! Why? Why? You might have been an asshole, but you don't deserve this. I don't know. They even know the character.
Wish there was a save point up there. Would have been a little bit quicker. Hold on. That's the coastal tower marked on the map. Must be the way to get down from here and reach the shore below. Let's try not to die this time. So I just stuck at that rat. I will say for a low budget game, it's really not that bad for draw distance. I mean, yeah, I mean, it doesn't look fantastic, but it doesn't look awful either. Don't think I can reach there, man. It is annoying that I died, but on the other side of the coin, it's nice that I actually have to do my jumps properly instead of uh, the computer roughly giving me an advantage. Let's try this again. Yes! Just don't mess this up. Ooh, ooh. Oh. Yeah, this is not for Right, I'm going to try it one more time. Yes, I'm sure. And if I die again, I'll call it quits there. And I'll continue the next night because I've been... Well, not too late, I suppose. I will be fast forward then for the video. Rashid. Oh no, you're dead. Did not know oh, that. Fuck. Oh no. This can't be happening. Why? Why? You might have been an asshole, but you don't deserve this. Hi. Just saved it there, so hopefully I won't hear that again. Hold on. That's the coastal tower marked on the map. Must be the way to get down from here and reach the shore below. in there. Because you don't know how much you just quick save them when you... Hmm. 
Oh. Oh, thank you. Just take a breather from that. Thank you, Seagull. Nope. Oh, fire, yes. Get that saved. So for that, just had a quick save that because I did not want to do that again. How high up are we? Anyway. There's going to be an axe man. Rat. Right, that's open. That's it, run by the power of the crowbar. That will kill all dogs on the island, would it? I should have done that. That was a very weird way to climb down a ladder. Yeah, glad I didn't jump from there, I would have killed myself.
Ah, oh, that's cool. Daddy, what kind of knot is this? It's the Todd Line Hitch. It's one of the handiest all-purpose knots, especially useful when you go camping. You're the smartest daddy in the world! To make a stone knife, you'll need a sharp-edged piece of stone or scrap metal. Why would I make a knife? Why don't we just bring one from home? The less gear you bring, the more intimate of an experience you'll have with nature. Also, you can't always rely on your gear as a safety net. To survive, you must learn to be creative and find solutions with the material you find around you. Cool. So there's save points. Well, not save point, but I can actually make something now. Guess not. That looks safe. Let's climb it. Is that a psycho killer? I obviously don't know where to go for me. No. I want to climb that again. My guess is that this door is going to be locked. Ah, it's open. Let's stand here first. Look like a campfire. Shame we can't just swim out of here. Cannot play it. That is disappointing. Right. On that note, I'm gonna call it quits there. Uh, quite enjoying this one. Um, when I come back to it, I'm gonna go back to that tower and actually try and climb and see what's up there. And then, uh, yeah, see what goes from there. So I hope you're enjoying this. Um, leave your comments down below. Tell me how you're thinking of this playthrough so far. Excuse me. And yeah, I'll continue this on the next playthrough. So enjoy your evening and I'll see you again.